Did you know that today is Kimchi Day? Oh. Kimchi Day! Yeah, Kimchi Day. In Maryland, Governor Larry Hogan proclaimed November 22nd as Kimchi Day to recognize the importance of the popular Korean side dish and to celebrate Korean culture in the state. Of course, First Lady Yumi Hogan is the first Korean-American First Lady in the country. She has even promoted kimchi through her Yumi Cooks series online. Oh. So you're getting a little snippet of that. I love it. November 22nd is also Kimchi Day in Virginia, which was just proclaimed earlier this year. And I gotta say, kimchi has come a long way. <laughs> there was a time when you did not talk about it at all no. because you were ashamed or embarrassed. Really? Why? Oh. Take it because it really does have a acquired taste. Okay. Yeah. It has a, a, a smell that mm. some can't really tolerate. Like but it, you know. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> mm. But um, I, I'm just so happy that there's actual a day for well, it. Yeah. It's really come a long way in in the health community because it, it's naturally fermented and yeah. has natural mm -hmm. yeah. probiotics. Okay. So now I think oh, it's yeah. like probably Stomach more. Steel. Yeah. <laughs> we have to give it another. I don't think that I've given kimchi the proper time okay. to yeah. understand it, to well, we mix it into it. my. I'll bring uh, some in. Okay, are yes. you serious? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, we have a All kimchi right. fridge at home. We will taste the test. whole fermentation process is happening at home as we speak. Oh, I'm going to need uh, some. But you know what? In all seriousness, I think also this goes beyond just the side dish. It's Absolutely. a cultural yes. contribution mm -hmm. that Korean yeah. Americans have made. So I think there's that deeper meaning. So, anyways, yes. this, this is what I'm talking about. Living out loud. Unapologetic. All right. All right. It's a classroom in here. We're learning. <laughs>